Hello, I wanted to show you how to get started on the Frontline X240 Bluetooth Protocol Analyzer. After you have downloaded the software from our website, fte.com, you can go to the software download and install the installer on your PC. Then you will have a wireless protocol suite folder on your desktop. You can start the application for the wireless protocol suite. Here we can see we have an X240 connected to the PC, some recent log files that you looked at, some sample log files that we have added. You can have get started, getting started, quick start guides, and more information here. So once you start the X240 application, this will open up the wireless protocol suite. The wireless protocol suite is the application which communicates with the sniffer, the X240 analyzer. This is what you get on the toolbar here. You can see there's an X240 serial number connected. You can look at the licenses that are loaded onto this X240. You have BRDR, low energy spectrum analysis, excursion mode. You also have a Wi-Fi 802.11 A, B, G, N, and AC license on this hardware. And we have an 802.15.4 Zigbee license. So it's fully loaded. Then the capture record options are here. Uh, you can select the record options. This will allow you to select either BRDR capability or capture capability, low energy capture capability or Wi-Fi capability. You can only have one of these at a time initiated. Now I'm going to select LE and 2 megabit LE. You can also add in the option spectrum view if that is part of your options. On the wired you can have a HCI pod. We have two pods connected to the hardware. Here you can have up to eight logic lines available on the pods, each pod. If you are doing HCI capture you can select the transmit line and the receive line and configure the transport protocol that you're using for the HCI capture. If you have a Wi-Fi license then you select the channel that you want to monitor on the Wi-Fi spectrum. Excursion mode tab allows you to enable disable excursion mode which allows you to use the X240 as a remote logger. General allows you to select automatic gain or manual gain. We have filters that allow you to enable filtering in only LE packets with a given BD address. So here you can add in different BD addresses that you want to filter in only. There's an RSSI filter, enable filtering out packets with RSSI leveled and cutoff value. And here is where you set the cutoff value. So turn those filters on or off. There are your record options. So now you can start recording. We're recording, but we haven't selected any devices. So go to the wireless device pane. And here you can select devices that are live. This symbol shows you that these devices are now live. You can select one or all of those devices and then that will send the packets or the data from those devices that are selected up to the analyzer once you press the start analyze button. When you press the start analyze button you can see the packets frames coming in for the advertising packets and now we are capturing data. You can see the number of packets coming in here on the bottom right hand corner and the buffer capacity is just at 1% and that's how easy it is to start the X240 capturing, select the capture, select the technology. We will have a further video going over the wireless protocol suite windows and how to manage that. Thank you.